Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion The ozone layer is a layer of the atmosphere that protects life from harmful UV radiation. Ozone depletion can cause many adverse effects on our environment and human health. In this blog post, we will discuss effects of ozone depletion on people's health, the Earth's ecosystem, and more. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Human Health The ozone layer is a critical component of the Earth's atmosphere, and its depletion can lead to adverse effects on human health. The most significant cause for concern in regards to ozone layer depletion is that it leads not only to increased exposure to radiation but also to an increase in skin cancer rates as well. This type of cancer has been found over time to be more prevalent among those with darkly pigmented skins because their melanin prevents UV rays from penetrating deep into the body, where they could damage DNA molecules when exposed directly without protection like sunscreen or clothing coverings. There's no denying that ozone layer depletion poses an enormous threat to human health due to its potential consequences like exacerbating respiratory conditions such as asthma or even causing cancers when breathed into the lungs at high levels over extended periods of time, Ozar 2010. Scientists from all around agree, something needs to change before humans suffer. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Ecosystem The ozone layer has been thinning at a rate of 2% per decade. The destruction of the ozone layer can have severe effects on Earth's ecosystem because it diminishes protection from UV radiation, which is harmful to living things such as plants and animals. If we continue, this stratospheric pollution poses an increased risk for skin cancer in humans over time too. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Animals Ozone layer depletion affects animals in many ways. For example, Polar bears are losing their favorite food sources due to the shift of plankton that is caused by ozone layer depletion. Ozone depletion has caused a decline in animal populations that are at the bottom of food chains. This is due to sunlight reaching Earth's surface and not being blocked by ozone molecules, which have been depleted because they're up high where there isn't much oxygen for them to react with. Sunlight causes photosynthesis. Plants need it so they can grow their leaves while animals use it as part of their diet when eating things like grass or other vegetation but too many harmful rays reach down from space without any protection against radiation damage if this protective layer dissipates. Biologists say we should care about what happens here on Earth now more than ever before since these effects trickle all the way through our ecosystem until even plant life suffers significantly enough over time. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Plants For many plants, the ozone layer is a protective blanket that shields them from harmful UV rays. However, some of these plant species are no longer as protected and have to evolve in order to survive their environment without it. Many scientists believe this will lead to certain types of plants being at risk for extinction, while others may thrive with new adaptations around different climate changes or competition environments like crowded forests needing more room across the globe. With the ozone layer depleted, plants are less able to survive. Ozone depletion causes plant growth rates and development times to increase, leading up to a shortening of reproductive cycles for many species, including soybeans in Brazil, wheat crops in Australia, tree saplings around Lake Baikal Russia, as well as coffee trees across Africa and Asia. These changes lead not only to economic problems but also ecological ones such that weakened forests on mountaintops can provide habitat or cooling shade anymore, while at lower elevations. More intense sunlight turns water supply sour with algae blooms. Killing everything from microscopic protozoans all the way up through fish populations which rely on healthy streams and rivers flowing into freshwater seas like the Chesapeake Bay off Maryland's eastern shore. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Aquatic Life The thinning of the ozone layer has led to an increase in ultraviolet rays from the sun penetrating our planet's atmosphere. This phenomenon is thought by many scientists to be linked with a decrease in aquatic life, as it can lead to increased risk for bacteria and viral infections that those organisms are less equipped than humans against due to their lack of skin pigmentation. Ozone depletion is a worldwide phenomenon that can have disastrous consequences for aquatic life. In the face of an increased amount of ozone, many species are unable to form protective scales on their skin and shells, thus exposing themselves to dangerous UV rays. One noteworthy example is in Lake Victoria, where 95% extinction rates were recorded among mollusks after exposure from high amounts of chlorine caused by human activities like burning fossil fuels which negatively impacts the atmosphere's ability to filter out harmful ultraviolet light waves. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Climate Change Studies have shown that climate change is a result of ozone layer depletion. The thinning of the ozone has led to an increase in ultraviolet B, UVB, radiation 
which then leads to more skin cancer and other adverse health effects for humans on Earth, as well as damage caused by UV light on plant life here as well. This can be seen with creatures such as phytoplankton, who are absorbing less sunlight and getting blocked from it by increased water vapor levels due to warming oceans because they need sunlight energy just like plants do. Ozone layer depletion has been a significant factor in climate change, and it is not just the loss of this protective shield that causes such. The decrease or absence of ozone can exacerbate warming trends by allowing more ultraviolet light from the sun to reach Earth's surface, less heat escapes into space as greenhouse gases are trapped closer to our planet's surface where they would otherwise freely radiate outwards. This leads us back again towards global cooling, which we have already seen with increased CO2 concentrations caused by human activity over time when compared to about 3 billion years ago but now faster due mainly because there are so many more people on Earth today than ever. Before Effects of ozone layer depletion on global warming. The ozone layer is responsible for global warming types of plant and radiation. As a result, it helps to keep the Earth's temperature regulated and protect life from things like ultraviolet rays that can damage DNA. Ozone depletion has been shown to produce global warming by allowing more heat in our atmosphere than usual, which causes an increase in greenhouse gases such as carbon dioxide and methane gas because they trap heat very well so that more than any reaches space where it cools off again before coming back down towards Earth creating the cycle called the greenhouse effect. Effects of ozone layer depletion on agriculture The depletion of the ozone layer has led to an increase in ultraviolet rays from space. This UVB radiation can be dangerous for our agriculture and lead to a condition called sunburn on plants. Sunlight is also essential for plant growth, but too much exposure may cause damage that cannot always heal over time due to harmful effects such as DNA mutations or broken chloroplasts which are vital parts of photosynthesis. The ozone layer is stripping our crops of the nutrients they need to grow. Studies have shown that this depletion has led to a decrease in crop yield by as much as 40%. Soil erosion also happens at unprecedented rates due to increased UV radiation, which means we will soon be even more dependent on food imports from other countries like China and Canada. As if things weren't bad enough already. Ozone layer depletion effects on the economy. We are losing the ozone layer, and this is a problem. The depletion of the natural shield has caused unprecedented economic damages, from crops being destroyed to fisheries decreased in production by up to 50%. Natural disasters such as wildfires have also contributed massively towards climate change with an increase of more than 100% since 1980 alone, which will continue until we limit or stop our use of fossil fuels that cause global warming contributing now at 10 to 12 degrees Fahrenheit each year. We now know that because of ozone layer depletion, the Earth is exposed to an increased amount of UV radiation. This will have a negative effect on our economy as well due to more people getting skin cancer and other diseases related to overexposure to ultraviolet light. Effects of Ozone Layer Depletion on Acid Rain The ozone layer is a protective shield that prevents us from getting too much sun, and it also helps to reduce the amount of acid rain. Ozone depletion leads to more radiation exposure which in turn can lead to skin cancer, cataracts, immune system deficiencies, and other dangers. While less protection could increase drought risk or cause crops like coffee beans are grown at high altitudes not to thrive as well near sea level due to lack of moisture leading them susceptible for pests who eat up all their nutrients before harvest time. The depletion of the ozone layer has a significant effect on acid rain. This is because when there are holes in the ozone, more UV rays make it into our atmosphere and react with water molecules to create hydrogen peroxide which then reacts with nitric oxide to form nitrogen dioxide that can quickly combine with oxygen and moisture at the ground level causing chemical reactions that produce acids such as hydrochloric or sulfuric acid. Effects of ozone layer depletion on non-living things Ozone depletion and its effects on rocks are well known. In the 1980s, it was found that radiation from solar flares can deplete ozone when they reach Earth's atmosphere in an event called a solar storm. This leads to drastic changes like increased ultraviolet, UV, exposure for plants and animals as UVB rays burn through atmospheric gases to combustion nitrogen molecules into nitrates which stresses ecosystems around the world. The National Ozone Association estimates this will cost thousands of dollars per person, with about 20 million people affected by 2020 if no action is taken now. The ozone layer has been depleted in the stratosphere, which is where it protects us from harmful ultraviolet rays. This leaves mountains and high elevations more vulnerable to UV radiation than before, as these places now have thinner atmospheres for protection. 
Scientists are still studying how this will affect life on Earth, but many think that we may see a decline in plant growth due to stunted root development or even some species going extinct because they cannot adapt fast enough with climate change altering their habitats' environments too drastically over time.